Mitch Gallagher. Welcome to Sweetwater's Guitars and Gear. Today we are joined by a special guest, Josh Scott from JHS Pedals is here. Great to be here. Good to see you. Thanks yeah. for coming in. Yeah. So you've got a couple of uh, cool new pedals here, uh, but um, taking a step back, tell us a little bit about JHS. How did the company get started and what's your background? Yeah, JHS is a beautiful accident. Um, I'm a guitar player, a lot of session work and touring work, and around 06, late 06, 07, I had a broken pedal and I fixed it to my shock and then it became obsessed basically and it led to this. So we're, at, we're in, our, in our 10th year, mm -hmm. which is wild to look yeah. back in 10th year. Uh, we're, we're out of Kansas City, um, 20 employees. We do everything in the U.S. And uh, yeah, that's in a nutshell, that's the basic story. Right, right. It's, right. Like, it's an accident gone wild. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> That's awesome. Yeah. So you have so many cool pedals. Tell us a little bit about where you get the idea for a particular pedal. Where does that come from? Yeah, that's, that's, a, that's a good one. A lot of times, I mean, basically those ideas come out of, uh, I am a huge, just love marketing. I love the way things look and feel. So a lot of times I do it backwards. I'll have a great idea for how something should look an icon, a name, and go backwards and design a circuit for it. And then sometimes you're breadboarding and this something's really cool or you learn something new. Um, you know, it goes both ways. Sometimes the sound drives the look of a pedal or the look drives the sound. And so a lot, it's another case of happy accidents. Right. Lot, it's 50-50. Sometimes we plan things and other times it's a discovery. Right. Yeah. Right. Very cool. Yeah. Very cool. Yeah. So we have two signature pedals here. Yeah, these are uh, debuting here. Uh, yeah, they're going to come gear. out yeah, same day here. Um, so right here we have the Ruby Red. Uh, this is a signature pedal for a good friend, uh, Butch Walker. He's a really well-known producer, solo artist, a writer. He's worked with everyone from Weezer to Taylor Swift, Katy Perry, Fall Out Boy, Avril Lavigne. It's a long list. You know, he's a very well-known guy. Yeah. yeah. Uh, and then over here we have Mike Campbell's signature, the Calhoun. So Mike is most known for Tom Petty and the Heartbreakers. Uh, but Mike has this incredible, if you go to Wikipedia, it's like stunning list of everyone from Fleetwood Mac to Bob Dylan, the Wallflowers. He wrote so many songs, like a lot of Don Henley stuff, you know, co-writing. Um, just fantastic guys, both of them. And so we're really proud to put them out uh, and to do pedals, you know, with our friends. And so these are great, great units. They're both two in one. So they both uh, internally have two circuits you can use independently or together and then order toggle to switch between them. Mm -hmm. um, so the Ruby Red is primarily a Super Bolt, which is one of our popular pedals. That's the drive side. And then the other side is a custom two-stage discrete boost. Um, so Butch had toured a long time with the Super Bolt and he's a simple guy. Plays a guitar into an amp that's hot and wants something simple. Right. Um, and that was his kind of ultimate go-to dirt sound, and so that's what that's all about. Then uh, the Calhoun here, uh, Mike has a lot of our stuff. But basically, he really latched on to the sounds of the Twin 12, which is a silver tone type amp simulator, an right. analog uh, design, and then a germanium tone bender fuzz. So that's a two-in-one, a drive and a fuzz with an order toggle. Mm -hmm. That's the basic rundown of what they do and what they're about. Right, right. Yeah. So there's obviously a lot of controls here, for example, yeah. in Calhoun. What, what kind of things can you get in and, and tweak on this? Yeah, just when you're looking at it, uh, divide it down the center line. That toggle is the order toggle. One side is, you know, the amp in a box, a silver tone, dirty amp sound, and the other side is a fuzz. So you can do, you can shape your amp a little bit because the, if you use the Twin 12 as a preamp, you have a bass and treble control. You know, if you're playing through a Twin Reverb or something, a brighter amp, you can really darken it and give it some mojo, uh, make it feel like a totally different amp. And then the other side is, you know, the tone bender type circuit, which think Zeppelin and all that. And the, the latter Tom Petty and the Heartbreaker stuff, it's very riff heavy. Some of it feels like Zeppelin. So he really latched on to having the ability to kind of coax a separate amp sound and then have this fuzz for over the top. Yeah. Right, right. Yeah. So very flexible pedal. Yeah, it does a lot of stuff. Right. Well, let's check out some sounds. Why don't you go ahead and plug in. We'll demo the Ruby Red and then we'll demo the Calhoun. Let's do it. Thank <laughs> you. 
Josh, thanks so much for coming in and showing us these pedals. They're really exciting. You got a lot of different tones yeah. here. They're flexible pedals, very versatile. I think people are going to love playing through these. Yeah, we hope so. Hope they come. Sweetwater, check out the website and pick them up. Absolutely. Yeah. We're excited. All right. Thanks again. Appreciate seeing Thank you. Thank you. All right. I'm Mitch Gallagher. Thanks for joining me for Sweetwater's Guitars and Gear. Be sure to tune in next time. We'll have more guitars, more amps, more effects, and we'll be making lots of music. <laughs>